Welcome to Joseph Manera Presents. I'm Joseph Manera. You know, exciting day today. I actually helped someone that uh, I consult with close a $25,000 deal today for their film. So here we are in June, right? And it's in the middle of the mayhem. Everything in the world uh, that could go wrong is going wrong. And we just closed a $25,000 deal for a low budget movie, which $25,000 to many people could be a very large budget for a movie. Um, but we closed that with a product placement sponsor. We have to use this energy drink uh, three times in the movie. Very nonchalant. You know, we don't have to have it like, hey, take a look at this energy drink. You know, we're going to make it very uh informative and beneficial to the sponsor but at the same time we're not going to sell out and make it look like an infomercial so you know with that i want to talk a little bit about people who who want to get into the film industry uh people who like this gentleman who uh i was consulting with for for the last 30 days he's actually an accountant he's never done a movie before but he's looking to get into the film industry and you know, I'm not trying to sell myself here, but I am trying to tell you that sometimes when you go into this business, you can help yourself and save yourself a lot of money if you talk to somebody you know in the film industry. So, you know, what I'm saying to people out there is if, if they think like making a movie is kind of easy, hey, I'll hire a camera guy. And, you know, I always wanted to write this script. You know, and if you think it's going to make your money back or you think you're going to be able to raise money on it, you know, you, you, you might be in for uh, a pot of luck. You may be a leprechaun or you may be out your damn mind and you're going to lose the entire investment. So uh, take heed to, to what I'm talking about now when I tell you that it might benefit yourself to take a, a certain film course. We have the film course uh, called Funded and Filmed. What we focus on with that with that course is not so much teaching you how to hold a camera and stuff like that, but we teach you the ins and outs of the business of it, where to distribute it, and how to become successful with raising uh, product placement sponsorship. So what I'm going to do, uh, I had another consultation early this morning. What I'm gonna actually do is I'm gonna lower the price. So originally I think it was 1290 Michelle had it on the site for. We're going to do the consulting and the full packet for 600 So if you log on to joeseminera.com, uh, everything you want to know about becoming a filmmaker and everything you want to know about making money in films, which is uh, the most important thing. I mean, surely everyone could do a vanity project, start making some pictures and throw them here, throw them there. But the key to the, to the topic is trying to make some money, is trying to survive in this game. We proved something very important today here, folks. Very important because even I felt the massive slow uh, in economy with, with sponsors and stuff like that. I mean, everybody's budgets is totally freezed up. And we closed this. We closed this deal today. And that shows you that even in times of, of trouble with the economy, uh, despite the numbers and everything else, I still say people are hurting. I think that you can definitely uh, close some deals here if you're persistent, you have the right tools, the right team, the right idea, uh, and, the, and the right knowledge. You know, you have to have the knowledge on, on, on what you're doing. You could be a filmmaker for 10 years in this business and you could have lost money for 10 years. You know, at what point do you try to do it right? At what point do you try to make this venture profitable? Um, I think that the... The film industry has always had that reputation for, you know, the artistic abilities and, uh, you know, make a great film and, you know, you'll win an Oscar someday. And, and all of a sudden, you know, the filmmaker that's been doing this for 30 years, they look back and they say, shit, man, I got like 10 or 20 pictures that I made. They're all great, but I got no money. You know, I've, I've got nothing financially to show about this. And of course, you're building a brand. Right. We know that you could get that knock on the door. Maybe you don't. But the bottom line is, why don't you go into this making pictures where you're going to make a profit or at least, the very least, break even. You know, you have to hit that break even point. If you're not even at least doing that, which a lot of filmmakers are not, then you, you really got to change your course of thinking. You know, there's, there's a lot of people, uh, you know, like Gary, who, who is the accountant, basically never has never been in this business before. You might have a great idea and 
there are some tricks to the trade. You can take it from somebody like myself who's I fell on my face a million times. I, I don't think there's anything that you can tell me that you're gonna you can do wrong in the film industry that hasn't happened to me uh, already. I've always self-funded. I've I've worked with investors. I've worked with distributors from Hollywood. I've worked with that whole circle, the whole bullshit circle, and the whole real circle. There's two sides of that. I've worked with real distributors. I've got your content paid for. Um, you know, I can I can pick up the phone and call someone on Amazon and get my stuff up there. Not many people can do that. So you know, I think it's important to follow a certain path with this stuff. And I always said that you make your money, you try to make your money from your film and the sponsorship in the beginning. Everything else after that's gravy. If you're not dealing with that formula, I I feel sorry for all the investors that that invest in a film and they're told, yeah, you know, we're going to make the money back, you know, a year later. Man, especially now, especially in the last 30 days, the game has completely changed. I don't see how anybody's making their money back. You know, if you're going to drop $50,000 in a film, I mean, just do the math. There's only certain many outlets you can put it in. And everything's backed up. Amazon is backed up, man. They are like, they used to make a title live within two or three weeks. They're, they're like two or three, four months now, and, they, and they're not making titles live. So, you know, everybody's got this idea, well, well, you know, this is, you know, maybe I'll make the money off of the VOD since I can't really move and shake and do production right now because of the lockdown people like all right well let me go to these vod outlets i'll just you know make a documentary and put it up yeah all right good luck getting it in quick enough you know sometimes it's like a lottery system you get in sometimes you don't um but anyway log on to joseminera.com take a look at the course uh we are also standing by if you want to drop us a line or whatever we'll uh you know we'll we'll get back to you and if, if i can answer a couple of questions with email Nobody's charging anybody anything. You got a question, send me a comment uh, down on the YouTube or whatever, reply to that. Also like and subscribe to this to this channel, please. And then what we'll do is we'll just answer your question. You got a, you got a question as long as it's not as long as a thesis, we'll, uh, you know, we'll try to answer it and put you in the right direction. But I think that um, with filmmaking in general, uh, all the principles for funding and, and raising sponsorship, can definitely still go on. I'm gonna tell you that it's a little bit more difficult than it was before. A lot of budgets are gonna freeze up, but we do have a PowerPoint presentation that we educate everybody on. And there is a certain way to make a media kit. There's a way of making a media kit. It just, it is bulletproof in any economy. It just spells success. And sponsorships love that. At the end of the day, Big companies and big brands know that the only way to grow their brands and the only way to sell more is advertise more, but advertising in the right spots. With our program, we show you how to market in the right spots and we show you how to show the sponsor that so that you can close the deal. Another great thing is we'll get on the phone as well with the sponsor and see to it that we close the deal all the way through. So I hope this video was informative. Uh, If it was, like, subscribe, comment. Uh, And like I said, you got any questions? Throw it down in the link. Otherwise, go to joesimonera.com and see what's up. Lights, camera, action.